What's up, everyone? This is Supersonic71087 along with... Jeff1387. What's up, guys? We are the Big End Dudes, bringing you another episode of Mega Man X. Clean! <laughs> <laughs> and the last episode, we went through the intro stage, we took down Chill Penguin, yep. and Spark Mandrill. Yep. In this episode, we are going to take down... Oh, Jap is going to take down. <laughs> yeah, we're going to take on the next boss. This guy here. Yeah, yeah, that guy. We're going to find his name. His name is... Armored Armadillo. Oh, yeah. The funny looking rodent. <laughs> Let's do this. Ah, uh, this song. Oh, oh I missed actual life. life. That's okay. Oh. <laughs> Trying to get through in the middle. <laughs> right through the middle. Oh. Dang. Crazy peacock. Alright, All right, so. Since Jap, you're the only one that pretty much know this game inside and out you pretty much know what you're doing yeah hope so, so. <laughs> you can pretty much describe like what you're doing here since I don't know too well and you're running into things which is <laughs> oh there's the med tours or med tools whatever you want to call them and the game is having quite a major slowdown yeah a major slowdown that's fine um if I was fast enough and when I get the helmet you'll get those things up there but that's fine I'm gonna backtrack a little bit. Um, there's a little secret here. Ooh, a secret! <laughs> oh, a secret! <laughs> ah, an energy tank! Yeah, those come very, very useful. And Especially if you're newbish. Yeah, <laughs> basically, what those things do is that um, it'll replenish your health. Well, not really replenish your health right away. You have to store energy first. Yep. And then once it's up to full health, you'll recover everything practically. Mm -hmm. At least I think that's right. Yeah, exactly. It's kind of like having an extended life. Or to the point where you're gonna die, you can refill. It's like an extra chance. So yeah. see like how Jesse's um, grabbing those energy pellets. It'll just um, soar right into the energy tank. Yep. Um, you'll hear like a different sound. Um, like, hey! <laughs> so that means that you're storing energy as long as you have full health. Yeah. As long as you have full health, it'll just put them right into the energy tank. Yep. And watch out for those spikes, those will instantly kill you. Yep. If it was a Pokemon battle, then, you know, Pokemon will win automatically. Yeah. <laughs> I'll need to lay, lay one layer. <laughs> one layer, two layers, three layers. Whoa! Whoa, that was pretty fast. <laughs> yeah. No, another secret. Another secret! Hope I get fast enough here. If you don't get it fast enough, hopefully I get it here. Uh, I might have to start over. Let's see. So I'm guessing you just gotta kill this guy, yep. Oh no. No! Oh, oh, oh you got, got it, sweet. <laughs> and those hearts, <laughs> it'll just extend your um, life gauge by just a smidget. Yep. <laughs> There's eight of them in total, hence the eight bosses, so you'll be able to get, get one in each stage. Just plowing through the enemies and another way. There will be a secret here, and we'll come back here later on. <laughs> <laughs> Just like that, we're at our next boss. Oh yeah. All right, now Jesse's switching to the electric spark. Is that what it was called? Yeah, I think that's the name. That's the weakness for this boss. Yeah. Kind of ironic, right? Electricity works on ground. <laughs> <laughs> Well, in Pokemon, it's like completely opposite. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, he's like, be careful when he rolls around. He's pretty fast. Oh, it seems like you got him in a lock. Oh, he's done. <laughs> there you go. Kind of rusty, but I can... Yeah, that went okay. <laughs> well, at least you didn't die. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there were some spikes there. That would have been instant death. <laughs> Alright, so Armored Armadillo has been vanquished. There you go, boss number three. And on to our next one. Alright, so we obtain Rolling Shield. <laughs> and yes, more useless passwords. Well, maybe useful, but... If you had a Super Nintendo back in the day, it would have been very useful. Yeah. <laughs> boss number four. Alright, next boss.
Launch Octopus. I'd say, in my opinion, maybe the toughest boss, because he has, like, homing missiles or homing fish missiles. <laughs> fish missiles. <laughs> in my opinion, like, my favorite uh, special attack that you can get from many of the bosses. Because yeah. it does target on any enemy. Oh, uh, yeah. See, I don't really remember this from Maverick Hunter X because I had a PSP, like, uh, well, when I bought it, this was like a few years ago, I had the PSP and Mega, Mega Man Maverick Hunter X was my first game. So I pretty much played the daylights out of that game, although I'm not remembering anything as we're doing this LP. <laughs> but yeah, like after four weeks, like after I 100% completed Mega Man Maverick Hunter X, I haven't touched my PSP ever since and it, it has been like probably, probably three or four years maybe until the 3DS was announced, so I traded in my PSP since I never really used it. Ooh, and whoa! Extra life. extra life for that mini boss. <laughs> oh, these things suck. <laughs> yeah, those things... <laughs> Just charge up and fire inside before they start taking damage on you. Yeah. Let them suck you in and oh, no. you kill them from the inside. Dang, that was close. Okay, this is the harder version. You gotta deal with those platforms, and you gotta watch out when the thing sucks in. Just watch out for the spikes as well. Yeah. Whoa! Like oh, that. man. <laughs> like that. It's unpredictable when he's gonna do it, though, but that was kind of caught off guard. Right. Well, the thing is, I remember it can suck or blow. <laughs> <laughs> no pun intended. Yeah, no pun intended, literally. <laughs> suck and blow. Alright, now... Yeah, it's a pretty lame mini boss, and there he goes again. Okay, I'd rather take the hit then. <laughs> yeah, might as well. And he recovered some health. Yay! Um, not to lag, but there's something here. Want to make sure what's back here. Nice. All right, cool. We'll get a energy pellet for our troubles. Yep. Continuing on. Oh, no, there's nothing back there. Probably. Oh yeah, here we go. You got, got to time it right with the whirlpool. Yeah. All right, another mini boss. Um, there's actually a secret if you do decide to fight it. And you should find that reason. Here, go ahead and kill this boss. Whoa! Nice shot. There we go. So now that boss is gone. But what does he drop? Ooh, secret! He just completely obliterated like, <laughs> the land below. Yep. And the secret here is... It's another boss fight! fight. <laughs> yeah. So you can do damage on the head or on the tail, doesn't matter. But make sure it's on the either side. So you could stay on top of it too so you can sort of like, bombard it. <laughs> you can just see the look on his face. You yeah. get damaged. It'll still pretty much deal the same amount of damage no matter which part you shoot from. Yeah, exactly. So I guess whichever part you decide to kill it from, it'll just kill him instantly. Yeah. The face he's making is so funny. <laughs> I agree. The thing, I'm kind of being cautious because I don't want to kill him then when I fall on the spikes. Fall on the spikes, yeah, that would be a bad thing. I used to be pro at this game, but not anymore. <laughs> well, at least he still got it to an extent. <laughs> yeah, not too fast. Oh, now he's done. There you go. Overall, not too bad of a boss. Oh, nice, I might get something. Yay. Alright, uh, now. I need a secret. Oh, there's a heart. That comes in handy. So, another uh, life bar extension. Though it doesn't really replenish your health, but that's what the energy pellets are for. Yep. And then there you go. That's the only hard. No E tanks in this level. Nope. At least I recall there isn't one here, so. <laughs> yeah, so we're just gonna carry on with the stage. So, unfortunately, if you recall that boss I just fought right now, I gotta fight him again. <laughs> Hence the sound effects. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, I got him in the right spot. Whoa, oh, dang. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> Some slowdown kind of felt. 
Yeah, I don't know why the game is slowing down so much. Maybe there was... I guess it couldn't handle so much. True. There we yeah, go, now he's yeah. dead. That was a lot faster, right? Yeah. <laughs> First part was just a struggle, but you know. Again, because there were spikes, I didn't want to get killed again, you know? Yeah. Spikes so are super effective against Mega Man. <laughs> so far, there's only one death, so that's better than, yeah. I guess, I don't know. Game over. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was the only part I didn't, don't like. But anyways. Alright, so Jap has the rolling shield set up. For the fight against the octopus. Yep. In my opinion, a very hard boss. I'll bet I don't die here. Got those, those tentacles. Has that little tornado ability. And if needed, if you have low health, feel free to use the energy tank. Yep. Seems, I think you got him right here. Oh, maybe not. Oh, no, I think you got him. Ooh! <laughs> wow. What with my instincts? Just a pixel of health <laughs> left. Yeah, there you go, guys. Very oh, nice. Woo. Early. Saw the light flashing in front of my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go, boss number four done. All right. And then my favorite special weapon of the game. Horming torpedo. Horming? <laughs> I think they meant to say homing, but... Yeah, they put horming. <laughs> horming. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we tackled two more bosses, so we're going to end things off here. Alright. So, next time on Mega Man X, we're going to tackle on the next couple of bosses. And, yeah. <laughs> yeah, two more bosses in the next episode. Yeah, so anyways, this is Supersonic 1787 and... Chapter 1387. Signing off. Bye-bye. See you guys later. <laughs>